Sophie, do you want to help me with this? Okay. Yeah. Come here. Maybe you can help. Nothing yet. No, I'm going to ask questions. questions and then I'm going to answer so, If I need help, I'm going to ask <laughs> So, Eric, I don't know many people who have been in three World Cups. Is that... How did you achieve that? Well, I think it's a different time now, but when I, when I first made the team in 1990, um, it was just a collection of college kids. So, what happened in our... World Cup in 1990, which was in Italy, some of us quit and some of us thought this was the greatest thing in the world and we wanted to do it again. I went and played in Germany, John Harks went to England, Tab Ramos went to Spain, uh, Marcelo went to Mexico, and we built a career. So once I went to Europe and I, and I played well in Europe, it was much easier to play in a World Cup. 94 was special. 98 we stunk, so we tried to forget about that. But still, it's a it huge was, achievement. It was still, it was a lot of work. Um, as a professional, you just got to stay healthy. You know, it's the hardest thing in the world to do. Yeah, as an athlete, it's, yeah, it's athlete, one of the biggest, yeah. biggest tips. You got to stay healthy. Yeah. yeah. Well, she's a little athlete. She's a gymnast, so she knows. Yeah. <laughs> Who are your top three favorites for this World Cup? Uh, Argentina, Brazil, and then the dark horse would be Belgium. Belgium? I hadn't thought about Belgium. Why? They just have so many good players. Lukaku, they lost Benteke, but uh, Eden Hazard is one of the best players in the world right now. Morelis is better than we think. They got a guy named Cabrun, they have good defenders. Vertonghen um, is very good. Uh, Courtois, their goalkeeper, is amazing. And Vincent Company. So uh, they have they have a wonderful team. If they can if they respond to the the hot weather, they'll be okay. <laughs> well, we'll see about that. Well, thank you so much. You bet, my pleasure. How did I do? Did I do okay? Good. Thank you.